I'll teleport my relationships with them with you so that you would understand how close our bond is. Not a close bond like brother to brother or brother to sister or husband to wife, but a bond that's cemented in music. I feel bad for the younger generation tonight. And I feel bad for them because they didn't grow up with the music that we grew up with. Yeah. How, how can music progress as it regresses? Oh, y'all didn't hear that. Okay. But see, I'm very fortunate. I have a little two-year-old granddaughter. First one, first grandchild. And I want to make sure that she hears enough music content to know the difference between okey-doke and real music. I'm fully aware and understand that I may not be able to pass all of that on to her. But I'm telling y'all here tonight, I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Why? Because for me, a life without music represents no life. No life. I'm not talking about I'm not talking about the act of making music. I'm talking about the spirit of making music. Now, brother, I hear you trying to make this conversation about two people, but believe me when I say the day is going to come, you're going to turn the radio on and turn it off. And if you can't say amen, say ouch. You understand. There's a question that I have that needs an answer. And it's this.
Because Phil's been doing shows with me. How long, Phil? 20, maybe 21. And let me say this to you. You're looking at a guy who's an artist. Say yeah. it. Let's give him a tribute. Say it. Because he's an artist. And in the backstage, he said he wanted to do with his grandkids. I thought it was the best idea ever before he was looking at my young stage. So please, God bless this man. Yeah. And thank you for all he's done. Yeah. Yeah. Sir, thank you so much. Phil Perry, everybody. Phil Perry. Thank you. Hey, we got that joint, though. Thank you. Give it up. Give it up. Give it up. Yeah. Did y'all enjoy that? Say, yeah. yeah. Oh, I heard.